This is Twit. Alan in Los Angeles, Leo Laporte, the tech guy. Hi, Alan. What's this? Hello. Hello. Hey, how are you, Leo? I'm well. How are you? Oh, all right. So, a uh, question. I don't know if the uh, screener gave you the info. So, I bought for my son a uh, Galaxy 3. Okay. And I'm with Sprint. And I put, uh, you know what I mean, the child protection, whatever it is, that he's only allowed to make certain phone calls. Yeah. To the nu- to the numbers I request and things like that. The issue I'm having is with the app portion. The app portion only allows you to add three apps that he's allowed to use. Well, that's dumb. All right. <laughs> so on my Galaxy, how, how old is you know, how old is your son? He's seven. Okay, this is perfectly appropriate for seven year old. It'd probably be nice to have more than three apps. Right. So here is what my question is: I have on my Note three. There's an app called Kids Mode, and within that, I right. can add everything that he wants to. So my thought was to do the same thing, was to download one of those Kid Mode apps, add everything in there, and that way he can just click that one app, and within there have all of his games and his sketchbook and all that available. That's a great idea. Okay, so the one that was available on the, I guess, the market for the Galaxy 3, what happens is it puts the app there, it opens the app, but when you want to open one of the apps I approved in there, it takes him back to the lock screen. Oh. So So it must be that that app works not by having all those apps inside of it, but just by launching another app. Right, so you put the apps in there, and you and can set a timer. And since you and limited like to that. three, it won't let you launch all the apps you want. Right, so that's why when it only limited me to three, my idea was to get one of those kid mode apps. No, I understand, yeah, but it sounds like the kid mode app is not is is just right. launching other... You know, you can probably... The S3 is uh, capable of running more modern uh roms you probably could update the s3 to a point where it would be as capable as the note right so i did what that was the first thing i did before doing anything i did all the firmware updates oh, good. samsung updates and yeah. i did that prior to even starting with the features of that because i didn't know how it was going to interfere the one that with the kids mode app that's available on the note 3 i can't find that one it's not in the, the samsung store no, I can't find it in the Samsung market. I can't find it in the, the Google Play market, that specific one. There are other ones, but so far, none of the ones that I've used have worked. So that's why I was seeing if, you, if the board or the, you know, I mean, your bulletin board has any suggestions on how, because, you know, he is seven, but he wants that availability to, you know, play a game for one minute and switch it out to the next and, all right, so I've looked around, and you can go to third parties and get the kid mode file. You have the to the one that's available for the Note Three. Yeah, yeah, because it's okay. just an application, um, mm-hmm. and it would give your phone the same capabilities. But in order to do it, you have to get it from somebody who's made it available, kind of illegally. Uh, oh, off the it's an off the record download. This happens a lot in Android. They they the files the program files are called APK files, and uh-huh. um, you know I see an article on a, a site that says here's a guy who's got the APK for the kid mode from the Note Three. You could put it on your your, your S three and it'll work just fine. So look around and find it. There are some other recommendations like Kids Place. We'll put those in the show notes at TechGuyLabs.com. So Uncle Bick is recommending uh, Kids Place. So this is probably a better way to go is with a third-party app. I, I get so nervous uh, if you go on online. You know, this, this article, this guy, uh, this guy named uh, J- Jose0726 has taken the kid mode file and lets you download it. You know, who's this Jose? And why is he number 0726 and so forth? But... So if you could find a reliable source, you can download it and install it. Just it doesn't nobody's offering it in the store. However, here are here is, and this is probably a better way to go, um, an app from KiddoWare called Kids Place Parental Control that lets you do more. This actually looks really good. I'm gonna have to install it and play with it. <laughs> 